Good morning, good morning, good morning, good morning, oh, oh, good morning. Hey y'all, what's going on? It's been a while since we've been on here. Absolutely too long, y'all. Today is December the 2nd. Oh, it's a cat. It's a baby cat. It is December the 2nd, 2019, you guys. You know, last week was the week of Thanksgiving. So, let me tell y'all. Even though today is day uh, 36, it's really not. Because the last time we worked out was Wednesday. And we haven't been back to the gym since then. Um... I mean, we, we've been moving, but we haven't really been working out. So, it's uh, technically day 36, but last Wednesday was the last day we worked out. Um, we've been cutting up for the holidays. You know, I don't think that's going to happen for Christmas. Uh, Planet Fitness was closed for the holidays, but, you know, it still could have been some type of workout regime. You know, because it was closed, I took off. So today is waiting day. I don't know what's going down on today, y'all. But it's all good, though. And y'all see that I'm holding my phone. I broke my little gadget. So I have to get a new one, y'all. Y'all pray for your girl. She get a new gadget. But anyway, you guys are uh, on our way to the gym. It's a blessing to be up this morning. Um, I've been missing it. Um, just excited thanking God for another day breathing the breath of life in us um, praying I was praying this morning and it just came across my mind so much stuff that's going on I saw a video before I went to sleep last night that was uh, sent to me from my sister-in-law and my father-in-law oh, excuse me my nose y'all I know y'all be tired of me rubbing my nose like that in these videos but I gotta oh, just be itching this soon but anyway about um like sex trafficking and things like that um i saw it it broke my heart like this lady she was jogging and she said a man was following her and she saw this other lady and she started screaming for this other lady to help her so the lady drove her to her car or walked with her to her car and she did a video and you know it broke my heart to know that you know trying to trying to live and work out and do things and take care of yourself and just trying to live period you know children trying to go to school you know what i mean there's people out here that's wicked and evil that will take them and sell them just for money you know money that love of money right there that's that stuff is that is the root to all evil you guys like people you know they they lose their mind when it comes to trying to make it you know but that's when they're trying to do things in their own strength you know what i mean like god say he's our provider he's called jehovah jireh you know there's some there's gonna be some hard times and there's gonna be some rough times but we gotta understand that god is in control of everything you know um going through it you don't understand because you know i've been there done that but to to go to a, a level of evilness on to that strength like to grab somebody and and sell them to somebody else for sex like you know that has went to a whole nother level of wickedness you know and i'm just praying for our nations i'm praying for the world you know that that they come back into the fear of god and you know come back into trusting god you know what i mean and and knowing that god loves us so much so um and i was just praying about that this morning and you know it's just we we have to begin to pray as as a um as a body as the body of christ i'm um, just speaking right now to my believers you know because those fervent prayers they avail of much the word of god declares that and as a believer we must believe that a fervent prayer of a righteous man avail of much i mean let's talk about elijah how he prayed that it didn't rain you know what i mean and it didn't 
if we believe what we're praying and we're fervent about about it and we're right standing with the Father, you know, the Word of God says, ask anything in my name and you shall receive, you know, and I just really believe God's Word. I'm just crazy enough to believe that whatever I ask in the name of Jesus that I'm going to receive, you know, and, and I just pray and ask God to touch the hearts of, of His people, you know, on in this in this day and time you know i ask god to uh touch the hearts of his sons and daughters that we stick together and love one another and not be in competition with one another divided you know because a house divided won't last you know and us as the body of christ we have to get it together and come on one accord in love and unity that we can chase this devil out of here put the devil on the run you know he laughing at us we need order in our body you guys but anyway i love y'all man we just got to begin to pray and not just pray but pray and believe that it is done when you say amen i'm gonna need you to know that it is done it is finished when you say amen amen well i love y'all day 36 well not really <laughs> And a lifetime to go. Almost there. I'll talk to y'all when I get back out.